Following the car crash on Monday, October 25, which led to the death of Pastor Kevin O. Smith, the man at the epicenter of the recent bizarre human sacrifice saga in Montego Bay, members of the dance fraternity have reacted to the passing of the clergyman. According to the Jamaican Gleaner, Smith was being transferred from Montego Bay to Kingston by police officers to face murder and other charges linked to the religious ritual in which two people were killed at his church, the Pathways International Kingdom Restoration Ministries in Montego Bay on Sunday, October 17. Reports from the Jamaica Constabulary Force are that a police officer also perished in the crash, which happened along the Bug Walk Bypass in St. Catherine, the home parish of the pastor at about 9.30 Monday morning. Controversial music selector Futa Hype was among the first to take to Instagram to pour skepticism on what transpired, questioning whether or not the pastor's demise was staged. He asked his followers on Instagram before taking to YouTube to do a live feed in which he questioned the sequence of events and said the entire scenario appeared shady. There were some artists like the general public who had likened the events involving the pastor to a Netflix series as according to them, never in their wildest dreams would they have thought that human sacrifices and the ensuing shenanigans would be a reality in Jamaica. Mr. Lex quipped on ZJ Sparks IG page where the news of the crash was posted asking, then I saw the show done? ZJ Sparks pointed to the ominousness of the number 9, which appeared to be the favorite number of Smiths based on his frequent use of the numbers 999 in his Facebook post. She said, What are the odds the accident took place on Church Street in St. Catherine, the parish he is from? He dies on the ninth day after the incident, nine something in the morning after approximately nine officers who were a part of the team transported him to Kingston. The drama involving Smith unfolded two Sundays ago when a joint team of the JDF, soldiers and police officers stormed the church at about 7 o'clock that evening after they reportedly received information that the religious cult was in the process of sacrificing some of its members. Upon infiltrating the premises, the security forces were reportedly shot at by members of the religious cult. When the gunfire ended, the soldiers and police searched the building and found the body of a woman clad in white who had been sacrificed, laying face down with her throat slashed, allegedly by a member of the church. Additional reports are that a male member of the church was also discovered lying, suffering from a stab and gunshot wounds to his back and reportedly said that he was shot and stabbed by the pastor. The man reportedly told the security forces that he was about to be sacrificed by the religious cult. In addition to the two church members who were killed, a third man was attacked by security forces with a knife, was shot dead. A male member of the church who had allegedly attacked lawmen with a knife was shot dead by security forces while Smith was taken into custody along with a bevy of female members of his church and their male counterparts. For the full article, remember to check the link in the description box but don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Downtown Mag for upcoming news.